fucking crazy. What? Oh, okay. Officers responded to a call of a male who was attempting to break into a vehicle. When they arrived, they contacted Dijon Landrum, attempting to drive away in a stolen vehicle. The vehicle had been stolen out of East Los Angeles. In addition to driving a stolen vehicle, he had stolen property and narcotics with him. He was arrested. Due to the California Zero Bell policy, he was issued a citation and released. My man's Dijon was driving a stolen vehicle with stolen property and narcotics. And the California police had to give him a ticket. Approximately one after after he was released at about 2.20 p.m., we received a call of an unknown male in the area of Bennett in Pennsylvania. The male was carrying a box and walking through front yards of residences. It appeared that the male was placing items in the box he was walking as he was walking through the property. So my man's Dijon is now walking with a box through people's yards like it's the grocery store and just putting shit he likes in it. When we arrived, we contacted Dijon Landrum a second time and it appeared he had property in his possession that did not belong to him. Due to the California zero bell policy, he was issued a citation and the property was recovered by our officers. Several hours later at 8.49, we received a call of a vehicle that had just been stolen out of a parking lot in South Grand Avenue. Our officers were able to track the vehicle and found it westbound on the 10 freeway in the area of La Puente. Uh, with assistance from outside agencies, they located the vehicle and a pursuit began. The pursuit ultimately ended in Pasadena and Dijon was again arrested for being in possession of a stolen vehicle and also for evading officers. Due to the California Zero Bell policy, Landrum was released with his third citation of the day. My man's Dijon stole a car, had narcotics, stolen property, stole other people's property after being released, and now stole another car and fled from police and they had to let him go. Good old California. You guys see why I rag on California so much? Hell, even Joe Rogan doesn't want to stay in California.